Assalamualaikum warahmatullah and good afternoon. Um, today I would like to share video on how to perform a 3D machining. Previously we have done uh, 2.5 or 2D uh, machining. Uh, this exercise or this uh, tutorial is more to 3D or we call as a prismatic machining. Right. Under this uh, sort of a tutorial, uh, under 3D machining, this 3D cam are capable to cutting complex shapes, moving all the three edges of the mini machine simultaneously. Uh, sort of the tooling, such as uh, bone nose. Oh, uh, frequently we use a bone nose as a cutter for 3D uh, machining for finishing and uh, flat and mill for uh, roughing. Okay, let's try uh, first instruction. Getting started. Okay, as user, you just click a machine of parts. Uh, this is the machine of parts. And then select a template, limited dot sm dot, and uh, browse the files, browse the file, three uh, d, parts file. Okay. Okay. Let's uh define the stock as this and stock. Use a stock as options. To define the axis x, y, and z, All right? Okay, this is the stock axis. Create a stock axis and define the axis. Where is the z axis? Uh, this is a z axis. This is an x. Positive x. All right. And automatically, the software will detect the y axis. The remain axis is a y. And then, uh, just fill in blank the offsets. Attention. And under stop type, select a use a solid body. Under solid body, select open. And uh, open and import a 3D stop dot part file. Okay. Use a solid body. This is a matter how to import the the, the stop file. Okay, and I click 3D stop, open. Okay. So, the internal part is uh, our main part. And then the outer part is a uh, stop. And I click OK. Right. Okay. And then uh, define the setup. Place the send out the level tag on the back left hand corner on the top face of the stock as shown. So we have to locate uh, the setup key is key uh, 52 on this vertex, right? Make sure you check this is the X axis, Z axis, and Y axis. Positive. And then click OK. Right, next, uh, 